Good morning, good morning, happy Saturday. Welcome to Energize Live. If you are watching this on the replay, please let us know because we have a big announcement this morning. So if you're watching this via replay or listening to it like a podcast, let me know in the comments later because we have a big announcement today that I want to know that you heard. If you're listening, watching, if you're with us here live, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I just, I'm so appreciative that you know, every morning we gather together, we make our energize, we have conversations, hopefully, hopefully we kind of fire each other up and, and set the tone for each other's day and we come together to um, create some really positive energy in the morning. So if you are here live, dang, I'm so grateful for you. I'm, I, I am just really, really grateful this week. You know, we've got, we have a home, we have power and watching the devastation you know, in South Florida, it breaks my heart. And speaking of that, we have an announcement this morning that uh, I'm really excited to share with you. And again, if you are watching this later on the replay, please let me know. And um, please let me know that you are going to be part of this announcement. Um, first, let's make some energize. And also, happy October 1st. Yes, we, it, we're in it now. Like we are in Spooky season, officially, October 1st. You're in the last 90 days of 2022. This is it. Like, you, you don't get to go back and do any of the nine, month, the nine months previous, but we do have three more months. And I just think, I think over and over and over again, we overestimate what we can get done in three months. Or I'm sorry, in a day. And we underestimate what we can get done in like three months or 100 days. That's why my planner is 100 days. I think people really underestimate what focused effort can do in 100 days. And we think we can get everything done in a day. And then when we don't get everything done in a day, we're like, well, we're just going to wait. We're just going to do it uh, January 1st. I'm not about that life. And I feel like if you are here with me on Energize Live, that you're not about that life either. And that's one of the beautiful things about coming together in the morning is we remind each other. We can get amazing stuff done today and in the next 90 days. So it is officially October 1st. You are in fall. You are in spooky season. You are in the last 90 days of 2022. And I would love, love, love for you to stop playing small. I would love, love, love for you to stop underestimating what you can do, the impact you can have, and the progress you can make. Can we make that deal that for the next 90 days, you are going to stop playing small. You are going to stop setting tiny little goals that you, for 90 days that you could accomplish in a week if you chose to actually put focused effort in. Can we, can we make that deal in the next 90 days? Yes or yes? Are you in with me or no? Are you in with me or no? I just feel like if you're up and you're with me on 7.15 on a Saturday morning, that you're in with me. That you're in with me because who, who no, one, no one's here randomly. Who's here randomly? You didn't just randomly stumble on this. And so for the next 90 days, can we, can we have a deal that we're not playing small, that we're not going to get in our heads and we're not going to go, I just don't know if I can do that. I'm so afraid. And then instead, we just freaking do the thing. We just try. You know what I'm doing right now? I'm not showing this to you because I, I am making such a mess. My ice cubes spilled everywhere. I mean, it's spooky season, baby. It's spooky season. It is October 1st. My ice cubes have spilled everywhere. As soon as I get this cleaned up, I'll show you. I'll show you my cup. Hold, please. Hold, please. Now, here's what I need you to do while I go get a rag to clean this up. Because I want lots of people to hear this announcement. Can you please, right now, while I go get a rag to clean this up, can you please, in the comments, tag three friends? Can you just tag three friends in the comments right now? So whether or not they're on live, they will come back and watch this because I want them to hear the announcement, okay? So tag three friends in the comments right now while I go, I can't show you that. This is a mess. It's a mess, people. It's a mess. I, it's just a mess. <laughs> I overestimated the amount of ice I could squeeze into this little cup. And so we have a mess. But we're going to get it cleaned up while you tag your friends. And it's going to be helpful if I just take a drink, I think. Okay, that helps a little bit. Let's see if we get the lid on it. Tag your three friends. Tag your three friends. 
in the comments because I want them to hear the announcement later. Okay. And if they're not part of Writer and Chai's Live community, maybe this will help them. Maybe they'll realize how freaking cool we are, right? So tag three friends in the comments. <laughs> well, I finish cleaning up this mess and then I'll show you the cup that I'm using today. Um, and they can come back and hear this announcement. Okay, tag your friends, tag your friends. Grow our community, spread positive energy, get people on board with our announcement. Tag three friends. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I love it. And listen, if you are in the Team Beach Buddy space and you're a Team Beach Buddy coach, you have <clears throat> like 500,000 friends that you could be tagging. So just saying, if you're already part of a community like that, you got a lot of friends that you can be tagging, especially for this announcement. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready for the announcement? Here we go. So, okay, before the announcement, let's just go out and look at the sunrise really quick. Let's just go out and you keep tagging. I wanna show you the sunrise. Because weather's the craziest, isn't it? You know, all week, it's just been so interesting. You know, all week it's been raining and we're going through our first hurricane and you see the, we're not staying out here, lady. And you see the devastation happening in Southwest Florida. You see, like I grew up going to Fort Myers Beach as well as coming to Disney. And I see those pictures and that pier that I spent my childhood on is gone. So much. You got kind of a quiet sunrise this morning. Kind of a quiet sunrise this morning. Weather's the strangest. And you, we, you know, we had a week of rain. We had wind. It's, you know, pretty scary going through that for the first time. Category five hitting the coast of Southwest Florida. And then yesterday, and really the rest of this weekend, absolutely gorgeous. Yesterday, I mean like 77 degrees, not a cloud in the sky. Absolutely gorgeous. Weather's the strangest. And this morning I was sitting at home in the lanai sun was coming up and I'm like, it is just, weather's the craziest. And it makes you so grateful for uh, this time you weren't in the path, right? There'll, there'll be another time and, and there'll be another situation and another challenging situation. And this time you weren't in the path, it makes you even more grateful. And because we never know, you know, if, A, we talk about this all the time. We never know if we get tomorrow. We never know when that natural disaster might hit us. You know, I grew up with, with tornadoes my whole life. Um, we had a basement in our house in my tiny little Midwestern town. And we literally had a cornfield in my backyard. So we were, we were prime candidates for tornadoes. And I can remember many a storm being in the basement and, you know, hoping that, that we would be spared. And... You, you never know when it's going to be you and you you never know when the path of whatever it is is going to come to you. You never know when that's going to happen. And when it does happen, you, you hope that there will be people that will rally around you and that will help you. And that's what we're doing this Monday morning. This Monday morning at, mark your calendars, mark your times, this Monday morning at 6 a.m., Eastern Standard Time. Yes, 6 a.m. Eastern Time. Yes, I know that's 3 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Yes, I know it. I don't care. 6 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. This Monday morning, 6 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Live on Beachbody On Demand Interactive. Jennifer Jacobs, one of our super trainers, is teaching a live 45-minute cycle and strength class. And for every human being that is on live on that 6 a.m. class, she is making a $7 donation to the Hurricane Relief Fund here in Florida. So if we have 500 people on that live broadcast, you do the math of what the donation will be to the Hurricane Relief Fund. And you know, we say all the time, Every, every little bit helps, and that's true. And what's really cool is when every little bit can come together and we can make it a big bit and a big donation. And then of course, if you feel compelled to donate as well, and I actually, <clears throat> I do have a link 
I meant to post it yesterday and I just, it, time got away from me yesterday. Um, but I do have some links of some, some organizations that can, that can do some help. Okay. So let me go back to the logistics and let me see if I can preemptively answer some of your questions. So m this Monday morning, this Monday morning, 6 a.m. Eastern time, literally, I don't care if it's 3 a.m. Pacific time. Do you know how many classes run in Pacific time on Beachbody On Demand Interactive and us little Eastern time people are like, um, I don't want to work out at 2 p.m. in the afternoon, 6 a.m. Eastern time, get up. If you're on Pacific time, <laughs> just get up. It's for a good cause. 6 a.m. Eastern time this Monday morning, 45 minute cycle and strength. Jennifer Jacobs is the trainer. And for every person that's on live, she will be donating $7 to the Florida Hurricane Relief Fund. Okay, now some questions that you might get. What if I don't have a bike? Awesome. Get Open it up anyway. And during the biking portion, jump some rope. Do some jumping jacks. Do something else. Because remember, it's a 45-minute cycle and strength. Cycle and strength, which is like a bike boot camp. So part of the class will be cycle, but part of the class will be strength, right? So maybe you don't have a cycle. Jump some rope. Do some turbo. <laughs> Run in place. Walk on your treadmill. Do whatever. And yay, Jennifer's on right now. We're, we're talking about it. Yay. Do whatever and then do the strength part. So that's number one if you don't have a bike. Okay, you don't have a bike. Number two, you're like, oh my gosh, I can't work out at 6 a.m. because of X, Y, Z. Okay, I can't work out at 6 a.m. because of X, Y, Z. Turn it on and be on live. Turn it on and be on live and do what you can, right? Let's not, and I'm speaking specifically to my beach body people, all right? I'm speaking to you as a beach body person, as a person who's been with this company for 14 and a half years, I'm speaking to you. I don't care if you're in the middle of a program. I don't care if you're in the middle of the program. I don't care if you're in the middle of Lift More. I don't care if you're in the middle of Lift Four. I don't care if you're in the middle of a program. You can do this class on this day and not get off track for your program. Okay, because let me tell you something. If Joel Freeman doesn't support the fact that you're going to help donate to a great cause, we have a bigger problem. Okay, and you and I both know Joel Freeman does support that. So if you're like, well, I can't do that workout because I would get off on my program. We have a bigger issue that we need to talk about because there is no getting off on a program. Your program exists to help you stay on track in a way that works for you. So that means if you're in the middle of a program and on Monday you do this workout and you start week whatever on Tuesday and you do it Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, instead of Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, you're going to be fine. You're actually going to be fine. Okay. So I'm saying that and I'm, I, I, I know that I sound a little bit snarky when I'm saying that, and I also am okay with that because I don't want you to get caught up in those little minute details when there are people three hours from where I live who literally have no home. And, and we're gonna go, well, I guess I, I'm, I'm in the middle of a program. I don't know if I can show up and do that workout. Really? Okay, so we're gonna just get a little bit bigger perspective here, and we're gonna show up and do this workout. So again, let's say you don't have a bike. Number one, I'm, I'm just gonna tell you my, my personal belief. My personal belief is that everyone should have an indoor bike because there are lots of times when we just need high intensity, low impact. I think everyone should have a bike. That's neither here nor there. If you don't have a bike, we can do little things to work it out, right? We can do little things to work it out. So as Jennifer said, 45 minutes of cycle and strength will be two interval sets with two series on the floor, focusing on, focusing on arms and core. There's no concern for overtraining. Okay, let's say you're not a Beachbody On Demand interactive member. You can get a day pass for $7. You can get a day pass. So maybe you're not a Beachbody On Demand, Beachbody On Demand interactive member yet. Cool. Just like you would, you know, when I taught, I taught the, the YMCA for years and years and years and years and years. And forever I would ask people if they could get a day pass to come take my Thursday turbo class. And they would just come into the Y, they would get it by a day pass, they would come take class, go out about their business. So someone's got a question. 
Yes, Melanie, you currently have a BOD membership. Melanie, we've been talking, Melanie, you're on my team. <laughs> we've been talking about this in our team page and um, it's also been in the team newsletter. We've been talking about this BOD body upgrade. <laughs> And yes, you should, I actually should have done that last month, but you can do that and you can just go to your uh, managed subscriptions and you can upgrade and easy peasy. Now you're done. And you, it's, it's kind of like buying literally y'all. I upgraded my bottom body for the full year on the same day. I also bought my uh, Walt Disney World annual pass. So I was like annual pass to health and fitness, annual pass to Disney. Feels right, feels right for me. Feels very on brand for me, <laughs> very on brand. So yes, like, yes, Annie, that's actually a great suggestion. That's a great suggestion. If you don't have a bike, but you have access to like, I did, you know, I taught the YMCA forever, in addition to working out at home. Remember, it's not work out at home or go to the gym or, no, no, no. We live in a space of and, we live in a space of and. If you do have a gym membership, take your your phone or your iPad and your headphones to the gym and get on a bike there and then go over to the weight area and then go back on the bike and go to the weight area however the class is structured that's a great suggestion Annie you can take your beach body on demand beach body on demand interactive to the gym great suggestion great suggestion um, I'm just keep going keep going I just want to make sure I answer all the questions and um, Oh my gosh, it is. It's it's so crazy not to have body, isn't it? Oh my gosh, the stuff that's on there, it's like absolutely insanity how much content is on there. And I'm going to be, uh, I'm just going to be just full on why you should have this for a moment. Hold on a second, I'm take a drink. Also, hello, good morning. Hello, good morning. October, hello, good morning. Listen. I am extremely aware, probably maybe more so than, than other people in the Team Beachbody space, because I come from the group fitness space, and my through line is my love of fitness and health. I think everything's better on the other side of a workout. I love fitness so much. I think it's it's so much more than a workout. I love it. And I came from the group exercise space. And I have always loved taking classes and working out. So even though I am a Beachbody On Demand, Beachbody On Demand Interactive member, and I believe to my core it's the best streaming platform out there, and I'm going to tell you why, it's also not the only streaming platform that I have. Take that in for a moment. It's not the only one that I have. Just like I believe Disney Plus is the best streaming platform out there, it's also not the only streaming platform that I have. I can hear my dogs. So maybe you have a Peloton. You can also have more than one streaming platform. You could also have Beachbody On Demand and Beachbody On Demand Interactive. Do you know why? Because the platforms, oh my Gosh, y'all, look at that. Oh, it's stunning. Stunning, stunning, stunning. Um, because the different platforms offer different benefits. Now, why do I think BOD and BODY, Beach Body On Demand and Beach Body On Demand Interactive are the best? Because of the complete package that they offer. We can work out all day long. We can meditate all day long. But if we don't get our nutrition in line, it's not going to matter. And let me tell you, listen, I have learned that the hard way. I have learned that the hard way, that the nutrition piece is really the, the game-changing factor. I've learned that the hard way. So why do I believe Beachbody On Demand and Beachbody On Demand Interactive are the best on the planet? Because they can have that nutrition component. And they're not the only streaming fitness platforms that I have. I also use Peloton. I also use Equinox. Is your mind blown? I, I had a friend come over one time when we moved here she was shocked that I had a treadmill, <laughs> that I had a Peloton bike, and that I had um, a Soul Cycle bike. She was like, oh my God. And I'm like, what in the, why would it, what? This is about fitness and health and living our healthiest life. And yes, I believe that what we offer at Beachbody, that's why I'm partnering with them. Yes, I believe what we offer at Beachbody is hands down unparalleled. Like, there's no competition here. I believe what we offer is better than what anyone else offers in the, on the planet. However, there are other 
platforms out there that I also like, right? So if you're listening to this going, well, I want to be involved, but I only have a Peloton bike. Awesome. Go get your day pass on Beachbody On Demand Interactive. Join us for class on Monday morning to make a contribution to the Florida Hurricane Relief Fund and ride that class on your Peloton. Who freaking cares? Right? Let's not get caught up in these little minutiae. Y'all, I'm going to do this class on my Soul Cycle bike. Right? What if you have a treadmill and you don't have a bike? Do the biking portion on your treadmill and walk, walk it out. <laughs> like, who cares? Oh, Jennifer wants to be in the bit. Yes, Jennifer, come on. Hold on, I gotta, I'm... Thanks a minute. Okay, there we go. Let's see if I got it. Uh, hello. <laughs> I, I am listening to you. You're fired up. I like it. I'm about to take off to head to LA, by the way. So I just wanted to thank you for informing your community. And I agree with you. You can have more than one platform. Come, come as you are. If you have a treadmill, if you have a jump rope, these intervals are going to be super easy to follow. And you can do what you can, but the most important thing is to show up for a community that is in need. So I can barely hear you, but all I wanted to say was hi. I wanted you to see my face. I was so excited for your energized live. Yay! Well, we will be awesome. in there. We will be full force. Awesome. Try to get Monday yourself a podcast spot so you can represent Florida strong. What's up, Melissa? Oh, yes. Yes, he felt on. Oh, perfect. Thank you. All right. I'll, I'll, they're like, put your seatbelt on. We're going to take off, okay? All right, everyone. I'll see you Monday bright and early. Set those alarms. Thanks, Jennifer. <laughs> okay, so there you go. There you go. You better be on there Monday morning. You better be on there Monday morning. And um, just know that you're doing a lot of good. And we're gonna make it <clears throat> we're gonna make a big difference. So we're not gonna get caught up in the minutia. We're not gonna caught up get caught up in the little details of if I have a bike or if I have another kind of bike or if I have whatever, whatever. And we're gonna just show up on Monday morning. So I'll tell you what. I'm going to put a graphic on my story now, and that'll have all the details. If you've got questions, then, you know, you can shoot them my way. Um, if you came on late, then you need to go back and watch from the beginning, you know? It's kind of like if you come into a movie late. Like, they don't start it again for you. You late, and that's okay. But you got to go back and watch it from the beginning so you know what's going on. So good stuff's happening Monday morning. Very excited about this. And I'll put a graphic up on my stories, and you can um, you can share that graphic and give some credit to my, my dear friend Megan, who made that graphic for me last night when I was, when Jennifer messaged me and I'm like, oh my gosh, Megan, we need a graphic. And Megan made it and she was at her anniversary dinner making this graphic for me. So shout out to my friend Megan, who just made this. And I just whipped it out. People who are talented with graphics are like, they, they blow my mind. So... I'm going to put that graphic up. You can share that. And um, Sparta Nation, my team, Sparta Nation, I'm going to pop over to the team page and give you some details on that. And I know Megan is like Megan's the best. So people will want to do this with us. Let's show up, make a difference for our health, but make a difference for others. This is bigger than this is bigger than just your workout. You know, it's what I've, I've said all along. That's why fitness is is such a through line for me and I know for so many of you that it, it is always more than just a workout and this opportunity that we have to feel better yes but to actually feel better knowing that we're making a difference we have that opportunity Monday morning so I will see you 6 a.m Monday morning on that bike okay um Chris I will tag you and you can spread that as well and it's Florida strong baby it's Florida strong we're going to help our, our friends and our neighbors here and do you know why we're going to do that because at some point it could be you at some point it could be us 
And it's real easy to look at the pictures and go, oh my gosh, I'm so glad that's not me. And then go on about the rest of our day. I was folding laundry last night, thinking about the people who were wondering where they were going to sleep. It's real easy to look at those pictures and go, wow, that looks terrible. Until it's you. Until it's me. Until it's all of us. And when it is us, we sure hope that someone's going to be willing to reach out their hand and help us too. So we're going to do that today because it is a global community. Rising tides lift all ships and the more we help each other, the more positive energy we spread. And I think the world needs all the positive energy that we can get right now. And I bet you think that too. So I will see you Monday morning, 6 a.m. I'll put that um, story graphic up. You can screenshot it and share it and get it out there. And let's all show up Monday morning and make a big difference. Jennifer Jacobs, thank you so much for, for doing this because you're, you're going to do the class anyway. Look at you doing something really good and making a huge difference. Like, oh, those are the kind of people that I love to hang around with. Those are the kind of people. So High Vibe Tribe, we're going to ride on Monday morning. That will be Energize Live on Monday morning. So you want Energize Live on Monday morning? Get yourself on that class. Everybody share.